All right, we're going to take a look. We had this brake that was dragging, and we've got a visual spot on the rotor where it's been blued, and then you can hear here, there's a spot that's catching, and it's just barely hitting in one spot, but we're going to disassemble this, take a look at one. All right, let's do an after, after our rotor replacement and our caliper rebuild here and see how it is now. Nice. We want to pump the brake. And then when it's spinning, stop it. Yeah, nice. Nice and smooth. No hitting in one spot. We just got that nice, consistent brake all the way across it there. So let's take a look at the different lessons that helped us get to the point of not having that brake drag. I mean, in this first video there, we showed how to replace and test the rotor, how to torque and install it properly. Then we moved on to rebuilding the brake caliper. And you remember when we found the brake pad pins were ready to fall out from the last job? Ugh, crazy scary. We went ahead and disassembled it, showed you how to uh, remove it, and then we found the sticking problem when these calipers were so difficult to pull out it took about four people to hold it and about smack each other in the face. Watch when it's done right. Boom, just slides right in, no effort. It was a great video. Then we showed how to test it. You know, you should always check your work. So you could see there we proved without doing any brake line hookup how to test your work. Well, I finally made my cutaway, all because of this photo. I've been wanting to do this for years. And you can see that a 3D model like that just does wonders for getting a deep understanding of how something actually works. We have hundreds of these at the college and throughout the videos. Every year when I teach brakes, I pull out my brake pad collection of just some of the craziest brake jobs where you can't believe people actually rode vehicles this way. This is a great teaching aid too. Nothing better than seeing new versus bad as a way to really try and deeply understand what's going on. No more stick and break for Bill. Make it a great day and keep wrenching.